I just picked up the van, just got on the road, and I am so fucking excited. Definitely a little nervous because it is huge, but oh my god, I'm so in love, I'm so excited. They just completed this van, I'm the third person to take it out, and it definitely makes me want to definitely pursue my thoughts of doing a van life rental company, and also 100% buying a van, 100%. I just gotta figure out the floor plan now. experience with van life going kind of funny everything's wet <laughs> don't know what's leaking <laughs> I love this love this luggage oh, PJs. I always want to wake up with this view Got in super late last night, had no idea what campsite I was taking. So walking around trying to figure out which one might have like the best view. And look at our friends that we're seeing. So I arrived super late last night, so I'm gonna brush my teeth and everything real quick and head up to the registration to register and pay my entrance fees and all that good stuff. I'm just gonna switch on the water. Oh. Okay, gotta conserve water. Can't just let be letting shit run like that. I'm 
literally still wearing the same clothes from yesterday, so I am going to take my first shower in the van if I can get it open. I'm keeping all of my bath stuff here. I actually went to like DC last week and just happened to like, I forget what happened with my bags and everything, so I grabbed a Trader Joe's bag from my friend's closet and now... That's just what all my travel bathroom stuff's been in. I haven't even changed it yet. I have natural soap that I made myself. And I actually just washed my hair yesterday, so I'll probably just rinse it, but I don't need a shampoo and condition it. All right, so I'm going to take the towels out. Put my soap up there. <laughs> so I got to take the toilet out of the shower. <laughs> A travel tip, whatever, I learned in Thailand with fellow travelers who were going backpacking all through Southeast Asia, they would shower with their clothes on, take the bar of soap, rub their clothes, everything, rinse off their clothes, take it off, rinse off their body, like, you know, soap and rinse off their body quick. And that's how they kept their clothes clean without always having to do loads of laundry. So I'm going to give that a try. Almost forgot, almost hopped in the shower. And forgot to even turn the heater on. So I have to turn the water pump on, the water heater on, and give it like 10 minutes. Because the temperature the temperature dropped like to 50 degrees last night. So the water's definitely going to be cold. And I do take cold showers sometimes. It's good for the nervous system. But not today. Not today, Satan. So let me try to figure out how to... He said it was like down here. I just plug it in. It's plugged in. How do I turn it on? Is that saying there? Oh yeah. Off. So now I just got to give it about 10 minutes to let it heat up, they said. So I'll set the timer. Well, I haven't eaten yet, so I figured while well, I'm waiting for the water heater to warm up about 10 minutes, I'm just going to cook me a meal real quick. So what do I have? Stir fry. Let's get some stir fry. Bought this at Trader Joe's. Let's see how it goes. All right, first meal in the van. I bought this ready to heat quick kit from Trader Joe's. Yeah, I'll cook it in this one in case it spills out some. Oh, let me turn the fan on. Vents on, oil's in, looks like it's hot enough. So let me turn that down a little bit. When I first plugged this in, there was like loud beeping and I had rented a trailer before to stay in, or uh, Sinjin and I did. And we had that same noise when the power was low. So that's what it reminded me of. I just didn't want to deal with it right now. I'm not sure why the power would be low on it. I'm starving, I just want to shower. So I just turned on the car to not even deal with it right now. And I'm happy I went with the deeper dish because, yeah, this if I did the smaller regular saute pan, this would be all over the damn place. Like watching my timer, I'm so hungry. <laughs> all right, one thing my mama always told me when I was younger, clean while you cook. And what I'm learning is in a van, you definitely, definitely have to do it. So my mom would be proud of me. <laughs> First shower was a success. <laughs> the water definitely didn't get so hot. I don't know if maybe I need to keep the heater on a little bit more or maybe it just, that's as hot as it gets. 